Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Grandia 2. In the last episode, we defeated uh, Selene, who was possessed by the heart of Valmar. We eventually made it back to uh, Samheim uh, uh, Cathedral to meet with Pope Zera, and come to find out Pope Zera is the main villain of the game the entire long. He's one of them pulling all the strings. He's, uh, he has claimed the story that uh, Valmar, I mean, uh, Granius actually died in the battle between Lady Even and Valmar, who just survived. Doug has been playing to a dead false god, a dead dead god and everything. And uh, he went to, uh, he made Elena uh, get all the pieces of Valmar so he can use it to revive Valmar. And then he kidnaps uh, and takes him to the new uh, moon. So we are heading off to the new moon of Valmar. They re try, to, try to rescue Elena. And, uh, Uh, and, uh, see what we can do about reviving, uh, getting Elena, and see what we can do from, uh, for, um, Pope Zarin to stop reviving Valmar. Let's see. There was something in a legend I found. Well, I still don't think that a legend you found, something about the Granite Stable, or was there something else about it? Yes, it was way back on the archive shelf. Basically, the legend says that the sword holds the power of Granite himself. Alright, so now we just gotta get to the Granite Saber. Alright. We're going to save the world. And we're going to save Elena. We're going to the moon. And we're going to the new moon of Valmar. Where his body and everything is being held at. So we can try to stop the resurrection. Of Valmar. And stop... Pope Zera. It's not Pope Zera. So now we're getting to the nitty gritty of it now. What an odious thing. The smell of me. That is the root of destruction. Yes, it is. So that's Valmar's mood. Tia, just plunge it in. Yes, sir. Alright, so we're going in to Valmar's mood. To try to stop um, Pope Zera. So now we're getting to the nitty gritty. We're probably about 75 to 80 percent done with the game now. It's not over with yet. There's still a bit to go, but uh, it's about to get to the nitty gritty. We now do the main. Oh, no, nothing lives in this place. Only this foul smell. But we uh, know who the main villain is, and we know what our main objective is. It's now to stop Pope Zera from reviving Valmar. And it's still inactive. The revival of Valmar has not yet begun. Don't give a damn. You need to get Elena back. Now. But right now we're at the point of no return. Once you enter here, you cannot leave until you defeat, uh, until you finish this. So let's be prepared for that. The camera angles are a little wonky here, so just be prepared. Can't go that way. It's basically a straightforward path, too, so just... It can be a little bit rough to go because we don't have a we don't have a healer. Although we can put the holy egg on Keo just for a extra healer. Because we're probably going to need it. That's pretty much a straight shot, so there's really no branching paths, really, or anything like that. Now we're entering the first part of Valmar's moon. Uh, I could have just saved it there, but that's okay. The other video was out and approaching like 45 minutes, so... Now it's, it's going to split up a little bit, and I think we're actually going to get into some battles and stuff, so be prepared for that. You notice though, it's, uh, it's like almost artificial. It's almost artificial-like. 
All right, we get a new thing called Nearmont, which is a more powerful version of the little guys that throw up. That throw the uh, buddies at you. Uh, we were too far away, so we couldn't get to. Oh well. Wow. If I remember correctly, there are a bunch of bosses, so be prepared for that. Let's power up. So, Rio is at max on everything. Merig, there's going to be two left, do that. She is max shell on her egg. This way, there is a uh, item. Cause the other way is the way to go, but I think if you go this way, there's like a treasure chest. So, makes it a little bit harder too because we only have three party members. Mm. There's one, two, three, and four. We're, also, we're almost getting ready to level up again, too, so. It might be the other way I haven't tried to test, but. Let's go the other way real quick. I think it might be the other way to have a treasure chest. Because that looks like the way to go. Alright, so that's the way we went. We went that way, so let's go this way. Yep, okay. Lion Harp, Lion Boots, and Leo Rat Battle Axe. Lion, who do you think this is for? a uh, item so now we can actually head to the right. all right we get a, po a potion of azure there and we get to, not, a, a, to a battle hooray look how much stronger it is though Woo! Love Lotus Flower. Alright. 
Look at that, look at that axe though. That axe is so good. Alright, there I go. Level up to level 44! Alright, I think this is the way that we came. Yeah, it is. So we need to go back in here. Then we need to head this direction now. Alright, now we're making progress. Looks like we get a new enemy here. It is called the Evil Maneuver. That's fine, I just want to lower your movement a little bit. There's one of them out of the way. And there we go. <laughs> the evil maneuvers aren't too bad. Alright. So we need to go. Yeah, like I said, it's pretty much a straightforward path with deception a couple branching off paths. Oh, I didn't even see that enemy. It blended in well. That's fine, though. So much stronger though. That new axe. No attack for you. Okay. Alright, that's fine. And both Tio and Ryudo level up to level 44. Alright, we get 6,000 gold. Which is going to come in handy later. Alright, so we can't go that way. So the only way we can go is... And there's more behind the Yeah. Alright. Oh, right here. Okay, never mind. It's right here. Cause I where do I need to go? Alright, this time I'm actually gonna do a little bit of healing. Tio doesn't have the best healing stat in the world, but, I mean, it's not bad for what it's worth. Yeah, I said it's not the worst in the world. Uh-oh. So you just be prepared for that because, like I said, they attack the person with the highest. And this is just a dead end. So. I'm trying to save up the SP as much as I can because, if I remember correctly, there is a 
box coming up, so I'm gonna try to save up the MP and sell it as best as I can. Burning Sun, he throws, <laughs> he just throws your buddy again, he doesn't actually have a name, so he's just called Bro Buddy, it's called Burning Sun. Nice and I said her, uh, it ain't the best in the world, but, I mean, it's something. I think it's better than what Ryugo and Merrick have, so. I like the beat of the, that, uh, his weapon calls him beat that now. That's good. There we go. Alright, here we get Thor Stone. I think we need to head this direction. Yeah. Alright. Fine. I got some of those berries if I need them. Yeah, that wasn't too bad. Alright. So we're now on the other side of that, and I think we're approaching Valmar's Moon 2 now. Oh, the other enemies uh, up are called uh, Sal Salamandile. Ow. There's one of the Salamandiles now. There's one of the... Uh, one that broke Buddy that down. Fine. Go. The thing about the enemies is, is that once they try to attack an enemy, you to cancel it, they will uh, continue to uh, try to attack that one of your one uh, party member. I think we can go this way for an item. No. Okay, we, I think we have to go that way to advance. Kind of nasty, but I mean, that's the only way we can get across. And I think we gotta do the same thing on the other side. Yeah, we have to go same thing on the other side over here. So, we go down here. And do the same thing on the other side. Then you can get across. Alright, so we're getting there, guys. Uh, like I said, we're uh, probably about 75-80% of the game now. So I hope they're all ready because we're about to have a wild, I did not even see what that was. We're about to have a wild ending. But now we're about to get even more nastier because now we get into the inner part of the moon where it's all kinds of blood and everything. Mm. Alright, in order to advance, you have to. So, alright, there's a. I think there's an item over here.
there's one of the salamanders down. Nothing over here but enemies. Okay. There's an item over here, though. I think it's just gold. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Then they can get to a save point. to the level 45, which is nice. Alright, we get Demon Ash. That's all there was for that area. Yeah, this is getting nasty, guys. I think we go this Yeah, we go this way. In the end, there's only one path to take, so... So yeah, like I said, this area, this area isn't too, too big, it's just a lot of, alright, here we get a Silver Feather, Miracle elixir, elixir, and a Mystic Veil. Mystic Veil will be good for, uh, Kia. anyway, so that's fun. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, these apps are starting to get a little annoying. Go up. Yeah. Got 
mad Dio so fast. Dio is just so fast. Alright, so let's go this way. Alright, let's see what the other direction is first. Just to see. Alright, that's the way we came. Okay, never mind then. So this is the way to go. Fine. Which kind of like that little phoenix move that you see. Right, so we gotta go this way. Ah, got surprised. Yeah. Light blue. <laughs> Even Beast King Bass is pretty fast now, as you can see. There's one of them out of the way. Both ways would have ended up the same. Oh, I think we have to go that way because you have to go all the way around to get to that. Uh... I think you have to go this way because you have to go all the way around to get to the uh, place where you can, uh, so you can get to the other side. Actually, going after Merrick this time. That's fine. We're about to get more level 45 for Tio and Ryu. You know. So I think you gotta go this way. Then you gotta go around the other direction of here. Bring it to the other side so you can flash that up. Yeah. But now, you gotta go all the way back around. So it's a little annoying. But it's not too bad. 
now he can actually go around this way, and now he can move forward. Alright. When we come back, oh, we're going to end it here. When we come back, we have, I think we got a little bit of a boss guard coming up. I mean, I can I think, and, but can we save Elena, and can we stop Pope Zera from enacting his evil plan from arriving at Valmar? Find out what's Valmar. Let's play Grandia 2. This is DKS3 Crazy Gamer. Sign it out.